Dear fellow researchers, dear GAIN community, it is with great pleasure that I welcome you all to the annual GAIN conference. As you might know, this conference is a classic in its own lifetime. And classics are classics because what they promote remains topical. Networking, dialogue and an open-minded attitude are fundamental to any kind of high-quality research. That is why these traits of an academic cosmopolitanism are actively supported by three German research funding organizations. The German Academic Exchange Network, the DAAD, the Alexander von Humboldt Foundation, and last but not least, the organization I have the pleasure to preside over. This is the German Research Foundation, the DFG. Although these three organizations have different missions, we all share the common goal of promoting an attitude of intellectual openness to new ideas and new perspectives. Perspectives that can change when you travel and live abroad, but also when you carry out research. Immersing yourself in a different culture confronts you with unexpected opinions that sometimes may be hard to comprehend and harder still to fathom. The same applies to epistemic dynamics when you pursue research. Here too, we may stumble upon challenging results and sometimes answers that are hard to digest. But isn't this where the real joy of academic work begins to unfold? This is work that many of us would never call by that name even though discipline and stamina are needed to take pleasure in the pursuit of intellectual adventure. It is true to say that seeking out the adventure of curiosity is not always the same as following an academic career, but it ought to be. And the joint mission of our three GAIN organizations is to help you find your own way to grow, intellectually, academically and personally too. Ideally, there should be no contradiction between these three levels of development. Whatever the path may be that lies ahead of you, we are here to support you. And I am very confident that the German research system has a wealth of precious opportunities to offer you. As such, this landscape provides many reasons for optimism, as it is both excellent and diverse, as well as providing an extraordinarily high degree of research freedom. A degree of freedom I myself always enjoyed and valued when pursuing my research career in medical biochemistry at the universities of Heidelberg, Würzburg and Gießen. Indeed, many of our partners worldwide are quite envious of this freedom of ours. Today, I wish to elaborate briefly on how this freedom manifests itself and what is characteristic about it. In times of a pandemic, this freedom even takes on new qualities, such as responsibility, Responsibility is entrusted to us as researchers in order to contribute to public trust in science and academia. After all, the pandemic has shaped our awareness of how vulnerable our interconnected lives are, demonstrating the importance of research integrity and inclusiveness in a new and even extended sense. In these times, it is more important than ever to contribute to societal cohesion, to fact-based discussions and to societal trust. As the president of Europe's largest funding organization for curiosity-driven research, I believe researchers contribute in the best possible way to the common good when they do what they do best. They ask powerful questions, they pursue the enlightening path of curiosity and develop scientific methods in a responsible way 
so as to tap into new and unexpected knowledge. Knowledge that results from curiosity-driven research, such as that conducted by the founder of BioNTech, Ugo Shahin. His work was funded by the DFG many years ago, laying the foundations, as he himself put it, for the swift development of the new mRNA vaccination method, which has gone on to save countless lives all over the world. This is the kind of knowledge we need today and for the future, a future that begins here and now. A new chapter might be about to begin in your research careers with the DFG at your side. So let me say a brief word about the DFG funding mechanism. As you might know, the DFG rarely works with specific calls. Instead, you can apply for funding at any time with any topic and any size of project. In addition, we offer plenty of special funding instruments for early career researchers. So, in a nutshell, we are here to build your future career. This has been our expertise for more than a century. And with you at our side, we will be able to build a prosperous future for everyone. A future that will depend heavily on the results obtained by tomorrow's best researchers. Now, let me conclude. Though these times may be difficult, both socially and in terms of research processes, may we draw courage from the fact that what we are going through now is exceptional. In a situation such as this, new ideas may in fact flourish more easily than under normal conditions. So be courageous and confident and trust in the power of your own ideas, approaches and solutions. They've already brought you a long way and they will continue to do just that. At any rate, that is what I wish for you most sincerely. And now, above all, I hope you will really enjoy engaging in discussion and drawing inspiration from each other. Thank you very much.